dead men tell no tales. I'm Captain Elric, here at the mothership.org, bringing you an unboxing of something really nice. I want to thank out Mr. Josh and Mr. Ryan from Fractal Design, and my matey Mr. Bill Owens. Ah, thank you all for sending me this new case for unboxing. What am I talking about and how are you doing? Today we're bringing you the unboxing and first look of the Black Pearl. I'll be cutting it apart and taking it apart for you lads out there to take a look inside of what comes inside of ye yon box. See you in just a second. All right, so check it out, folks. It's gonna be something a little bit different than normal. Like this time, I'm showing you guys the box exactly how it was shipped from Fractal Design. So you guys can see, we've got four corner blocks right here to keep the case. We have each of those on each side. And we have lock straps right here. The box came completely undamaged. So that's how it ships. So let's make the first incision. I'm gonna go here in the corner right here. Get the knife in here. Okay, let me see if I can cut this thing. Most of the time, these straps actually are a lot easier to get off, folks. Like, usually you can take them by these things right here and you just strip them across each other and they open up. Because they use a metal tie on this one, I'm not able to do that. I probably should have actually just used scissors in the unboxing. It probably would have worked better. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and just use some knife cuts. Luckily, they send these side panels right here. And after that, I don't even need to use them at all. I'll just go ahead and set the knife down. Take these out. You can hear them here for sound effects. Here we go, folks. I'm tossing it. It's like a spear across the room. Oh! Hear that? Nice sound effects. You guys love those things. And the rest of the case is pretty much just falling off after that. I'm just turn it around so you guys can take a look right here. Ah. All right, so here we go. Fractal Design, Define XL Computer Case. Now, when I talk to the guy, Josh, about cases, we talked about a few different ones, ones that are great for air cooling, ones that are great for water cooling. This particular one is more geared for air cooling. They have other cases that specialize in water cooling, but this particular one is an air cool one. So let's take a look in the front of what it has here. It's a full tower case featuring a stylish front panel with noise insulated door, unique Maju vent feature that lets you choose between optimal silence or optimum airflow. This is gonna be airflow controlling your fans, effective noise absorbing material mounted on side and top panels. These are like noise absorption panels. So if you have a bunch of fans going on, it actually, um, actually absorbs the sound actually, kind of like a sound when you drive by the freeway. Configurable thermal chamber design with choice is optimized thermal configuration. With choice, is to, it should be, I think, with choice to optimize thermal configuration. Okay, it says we have 14 drive bays, 10 internal 3.5 HDD bays, and four external 5.25 bays. Sturdy overall case quality, and it says optimal, well, I didn't even see it, it's got a really good kit, but optimal airflow cooling system. So like I said before, it's made for air. Two front fans. One front fan again additional, one top, one rear, one side with removable washable dust filters. So those are basically the features that are in there. Let's go ahead and jump in the box and actually take a look and see how cool this thing really is. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take a little incision here on this side right here. Make another one right here. All the way down to the bottom down there. Go ahead and pop that open. Now you guys have seen how I do this before. I'll go ahead and put the knife away. I will no longer be needing that. I'm gonna come over here, pull the flaps all to the side, set the case down, and then we'll just very easily come out of the box. No smashing, no banging, other than that. All right, then we've got right here the Fractal Define XL computer case, the color being Black Pearl, hence my intro being R, the Black Pearl. <laughs> That's what was funnier, anyways. So, you guys get this inside of it. Let's see what's in here. This is basically a basic installation guide. It just tells you like simple things about how to make your installation better. So when you open it up, you look in there, it just gives you some explanation about what actually goes inside of this case. Just set that down. Go ahead and turn it over. By the way, one thing to note real quick, you guys will see, anyways, right in the unboxing, Look at these really awesome feet that are on here. And you guys can see right off the bat here, so we're doing the unboxing. One of the removable filters right here that you can wash right here on the bottom. So that way if the dust is on your floor and it's going through, it's all gonna get caught here, not leaving your case all dusty. So go ahead and just move that over. The case is uh, quite heavy. 
Not the heaviest case in the world, but it is quite heavy. All right, so now let's take a look at the front of the case. I'm gonna go ahead and pull it open. You guys can see here, very nice looking all the way. All the little bay things, all removable. We'll basically take apart the case. So here we can see, there's one of the first filters that are in here. This is where there's going to be probably a fan back behind there. I'm gonna go ahead and pop the side right here. You can see down here, here is a fan right here. And there are filters all the way up, including where this one's at. There's not actually a fan in here right now, but I'm sure that you can put one in there. Now to put these things back in place, you basically just stick them in, stick them in here, and they just basically pop. So I'm not gonna go put them all back in, you guys know what that is. I'm gonna go ahead and close that. You can see there's a little light right here in the front. I'm gonna go in that head and now move it forward. You can see we have two USB 3.0, two USB 2.0, the start button, and your headphone and mic jack right here. The one thing that you guys can see right off the bat is this thing has totally like clean lines. This thing looks like a freaking, just really almost like a square little jet because it's just so clean the way it is. Let's go ahead and let's move it around to the side here. I'm gonna go ahead and remove the side panel. Once again, we have little thumb screws right here. Let me see if I get the camera to angle it on those. You can see these guys, there's thumb screws right here. There's also a fan right here as well. And even though the case isn't necessarily geared towards a liquid cooled system, you can see they still included two finger holes right here for you to use for that. They even pop out nice and simply and pop back in if you want to use them for bigger things. You guys can see, here's all the rear IO stuff. It's kind of different too because they're white and all the fans are white. So it's very black and white. I'm also just taking a look inside here. You guys can see the cable is braided, pretty nice. So I'll go ahead and go to the inside now. I'm gonna go ahead and just whoa, drop the thumb, thumb screw there. That'll be great for sound effects, but don't worry, it's not as bad as glass breaking, so don't freak out. And the side panel just gently pops off. It doesn't actually pull off. I actually struggled for a second and I had to get that out because uh, I thought it was uh, much harder, but it's very, very simple to take off. You can see there's mesh all on the inside, including right here. Very, very well made. And this is the sound dampening stuff that we were talking about earlier on the side. So if you have noise inside the case, it's all going to be absorbed by this, making it much more silent. Now we're going to move on to the inside of the case. Get the camera in. I guess first I'll try to angle it here. Here's the inside of the case where you're going to put all your CD drives and stuff like that. This is your 5.25 bays. Then over here on the side, you have all these bays right here where your drives are going to be mounted onto. You can use either SSDs or a standard HDD in these. They all slide in and out, very simple. Here's the cables for your system, including the USB 3.0. This will pretty much match up on any motherboard. You've seen almost all the motherboards that we've been unboxing lately have this kind of header. This will plug right into it very simply. In the back on the back fan, I'm gonna go ahead and move this back so you guys can see that. There's one rear fan. The cable's actually braided. And what's really cool is they actually include an extra rear I.O. little mounting thing. Not the mounting thing, but the cover. I lose these things all the time, so it's kind of cool that it actually comes with an additional one. All the way down at the very bottom down here, we have a bunch of more stuff. More and more bays. I mean, seriously, look how many bays are available here. Back here in the back, see all these little grubble grommets back here? These are all for cable management, so that means that this system is definitely going to be, have the cable management aspects that MyTech Ramirez really likes. So we're gonna go ahead and flip that around to the other side. Gonna go ahead once again, remove the sun screws. Got a pair of those. Pop the side panel off once again. And there's plenty of room back here. As you can see, my whole hand can almost fit in the back back here. So all this is for your cable management. You've got places for cables here, 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 here. So you can pretty much hide all of your cables. Some are still braided within this case. This is a very, very nice case. I think this is just honestly one of the best design ones I've seen yet. When I talked to people about Fractal Design, other people said, hey, yeah, Fractal's a really damn good company. We got one of their cases a long time ago. It was a lower end one, but this one I just have to say meets the mark. So hey guys, that's pretty much it. You guys can see this is a full tower case with all kinds of features, plenty of room for expandability in both your motherboard, your video cards, and all your drives. This was just the unboxing. Look for the full review as we build a supercomputer inside of this new Fractal Define XL case. Thanks for watching.